But damn, Forsyth, you were epic. Tasha, Gage, I'm leaving you in command. Protect our troops and our people. But, General... We have no choice. We must surrender and face, uh, face annihilation. I'll tell them that I started this war and that it was my responsibility. I'll tell them that I forced our people to arms. Never! You fought to protect us all! You can't take the blame for a war you didn't want! Stand down. That's an order of flight, Lieutenant. My final order. General, we can't... Do not despair. This Captain Brenner is a man of honor. I shall speak to him and stop this madness. Gage, do you hear what I'm saying? It is an order, sir, and we will carry it out. I would ask that you accept defeat and bring this war to an end. There is no need for further bloodshed. You are correct, sir. And I will surrender my forces to you on one condition. What is that? Responsibility and blame for this war will rest with me alone. I ask that you show mercy to all troops who served them on my banner. A fair request. I accept your terms. This is this man great! I'm grateful to you, Captain. I had heard about you, you know, with the battalion and his brother's wolves. And now I know that everything about what I heard was true. You are a man of unimpeachable honor. Please, don't praise me. I wish to only attend this idiotic war and return to helping survivors. And Captain? I am grateful that my last opponent was you. Your father would be proud. Indeed. Meanwhile. Alright, Rube. I'm ready. Now you'll see how Azurian faces death. Um, I'm sorry, what? Do it! Pull the trigger! I know how cold-blooded you rubes are! What, do you want to shoot me in the back? Fine, I'll turn around. Now do it! Um, look, I don't know what you think I'm like, but the war is over. You surrendered to Captain Brenner, and he's going to honor that. We're not going to shoot unarmed prisoners. That would be horrible. Ha! Where were, you, where were your noble thoughts after the meteor strike? You started this war, you offered peace and then stabbed us in the back! You killed civilians! You and all the other rubes, I saw with my own eyes! What? No! No, we would... Rubino would never attack civilian targets! Tell it to your beloved Greyfield! He spared no one! Women, children, even my own brother John! That... that's not possible! Oh, really? It's not? You don't sound very convinced of that, kid! Listen to me! Greyfield is evil! There's nothing you won't do to seize power! I can't forgive him, and I can't forgive you for fighting at his side! That's why we fought you! To avenge the depths of the Zurian innocence! Ah! What a douche! Meanwhile, Captain Brenner, Admiral Greyfield has arrived. Too late to help us. Brenner! I suppose you did passively well! Passively well? We kicked their ass! Hear me! The new urban army won a decisive and history historic victory! And now I, Admiral Griefu, will speak to the leader of this Azurian rabble! I am General Forsyth, commander of the Azurian- ah! You and your wretched army are a pathetic spectacle! A disgrace! The hell? Enough! General Forsyth has surrendered to honorably and brought the war to an end. Striking your prisoners against all rules of military law. Military law? Ha! Meaningless pieces of paper! We are the victors! We have crushed our enemies like flies! The only law in this land is the law of Greyfield! What? Now, Captain Brenner, I will usher in the rule of King Greyfield the Mighty! Jesus! Waylon! Dispose of this trash! Ah! Ah! General Forsyth! Captain Brenner, remember your promise. Damn you, Greyfield! He had surrendered. He was unarmed. Why did you shoot him? He was a Lazurian, and death is all he deserved! You're no leader. You're a coward, and if no one else will stand up, I'll stop you. Ah, oh, shucks, I'd be the bad guy and all, but you're gonna have to stop right there. Don't make me shoot you now. It's been a long day, and I'm tuckered. You'll pay for this, Greyfield! Listen to you, squawking away like a crow on a wire. This is Greyfield's world now, brother, and there's no one's going to help you. Take <laughs> Lazurian dogs to the intern set for execution! My great victory is almost complete! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Chapter 15, Icy Retreat. I won't stand for this anymore! General Forsyth has been executed? Are you sure? Yes. Those dogs! We must avenge his death! I hear that Greyfield has ordered us to be executed. Ruben Al Filth! They were planning this even as the excited general surrender! You're wrong. Captain Brenner would never allow that. He promised to protect you, and that's what he's going to do. I'm sure of it. Like he protected General Forsyth? Ha! You rubes were killed before the meteors, and now your true colors shine again! You're... You're wrong! What do you know, kid? No one tells you squat! Stupid! I should have seen this coming! Okay, yeah, you're right. There's a lot of stuff that I don't know. But I do know Captain Brenner, and I know he would never betray you! 
Regardless, General Force, I was still dead. Whatever your feelings for Captain Brenner, he's a soldier, and soldiers follow orders. You're wrong! Both of you! The Captain! The Captain! That's enough, Will. Captain Brenner, these people are saying that... I'm only going to ask you this once. If you can't give you a straight answer, you might as well just shoot me now. Is it true that General Forsyth was, ex was executed? Yes, it's true. I'll kill you! Tasha, stand down. Who was responsible? Greyfield gave the order, and Waylon pulled the trigger. But the final responsibility for his death lies with me. Hey, don't don't take yourself over the fall, Brenner man. I underestimated Grant Greyfield. I didn't think he would kill an unarmed man. Yeah, well, he did, and he's going to pay in blood for that. But I accepted your general's surrender, and now he's dead. I can make no excuse. I'm sorry. How do we know you're telling the truth? Believe me or not, I don't care. I'm not here to justify myself. We're out of time. The 12th Battalion is leaving, and we're taking the Luxurians with us. Oh! You're doing what? Greyfield's going to execute all of you in about six hours, but I've had enough. I'm not going to sit around and wait for his orders to, to be carried out. You need to escape. Now. Why should we trust you? Because if you don't, you'll die. General Force, I've entrusted you with the safety of your fellow troops, right? I still don't trust you. What's your plan? This place is surrounded by Greyfield's men. My battalion can't possibly take them all on. We're going to make a break and smash through the rear defenses. Once we clear the northern ice plains, you're on your own. That's a risky plan. Who's going to provide covering fire? We will. You're going to fire on Greyfield's men? Aren't they your own people? I promised your general that I will protect his troops, and I keep my word. Besides, Greyfield is mad. I can't accept his command anymore. I... I don't know. Well, you've got about ten minutes to make up your mind. Prepare your men. Oh, Brenner's doing something awesome! Hey! Hey! Escape! The prisoners are escaping! And Brenner's wolves are with them! Brenner! What is the name of Ruben all do you think you're doing? I order you to turn around and... The 12th Battalion doesn't take orders from you anymore, Greyfield. This is high treason, and the war shall be death! Death for you and every member of your pathetic battalion! You're a coward, Greyfield, and you don't frighten me. How dare you! You're a strong man who sees power on the backs of others. I'll die before I serve you for another second. Dog, prepare for your final hour! All units, make for the city to the west. Once you clear it, push hard and don't look back. Uh, I... Understood, Captain. Tasha, let's go, come on! All right. Don't worry about me. Save yourself. Command zone. The area surrounding the CO's unit is known as command zone. In this area, the attack and defense of nearby units is boosted. I'll talk about this more next time. See you later.